Okay, hi there. Uh, in this video, what I want to go over is the installation of a plugin called Twitter Feed for WordPress so that I can install my Twitter feed onto my blog. With social media becoming so popular, uh, Twitter, Facebook, uh, you want to give people as many opportunities to interact with you as possible. So this is a really good plugin. So I'm over here on the plugins page. I'm just going to click Add New and then Twitter feed for WordPress. I'm going to search. It's the very first plugin that comes up. I'm just going to install it. Yes, I want to install it. And I'm going to activate it. Okay, now this plugin is a little bit different. To actually use it, what you're going to do is come back to your plugins page and you're going to visit the plugin site. Okay, so I've brought that up over here. And then what you're going to do is you use this plugin by using a short code. Okay, so, so once you figure out how you want the Twitter feed to display, what I want is I just want my latest feed to show up on my blog. So I'm just going to copy this short code, come back over to my blog, and I'm going to come over to widgets. And what I'm going to do is in my sidebar left, I'm just going to install a text widget. And I'm going to paste that in there. And then what I'll do is I'll just change this to whatever my user ID is for Twitter. And I just put a header on this one so that everybody knows what it is. And I am going to click Save. Now when I come back over to my blog and I refresh. Okay, so here it is, my Twitter feed. So I don't currently have any posts in here. As soon as I do, you would see those posts in there. So what I can do is I can come over to Twitter and just let me quickly sign into Twitter. It should be the account that's active. It is. Hey everyone, visit my new blog. And then what I'll do is I'll just quickly put a link. Normally what I do is I would shorten this, but uh, because I'm not doing a really long post, I can actually just put this in there, blog setup for dummies.com. And I can tweet that. And then if I come back over to my blog and I refresh, blog for dummies. Let me make sure I got my user ID right, blog for dummies. Well, let me refresh that. Yeah, there it is. Hey everyone, visit my new blog and see it's automatically shortened it for me. So now if I clicked on that, it would actually take me to my blog, which I don't want to do. And so, what this normally does is it defaults to show five of your last Twitter posts in your sidebar. All right. Thank you for watching this video, and I will see you in the next one.